Hi, my name is Michael. I'm the head designer here at the Party Concierge. And today I'm going to give you a couple of hints on how to do a fall Thanksgiving centerpiece, inexpensive and quick and easy to do. So what I've done is I've gone through the garage, all the vases that you've gotten over the years that you want to get rid of. You can do a combination of different size vases. A lot of product that I find, um, you can find in your backyard or your local uh, floral department in the grocery stores, anywhere, roadside, yeah, that's anything that I collect along the road. So first what I'm gonna do is show you how to do just a floating flower. It's just a single sunflower, and you can use a couple of items, um, some rocks out of the yard. Make sure they're washed. Just pop it off. And there you go, just like this one here. Something with some height, little vase. Put some peppercorn, I mean some uh, pepperberries off the tree out of the backyard. Pull in a little bit of a red to it. You could do um, a red gabbara. Just a single red gabbara. If you want to put some foliage in there. Nandina, out of your yard. It's pretty color right now, it's just changing. It's a little bit of Nandina in there. Yarrow. Right now, your local um, farmer's market has a wide variety of flowers that you can choose from. Mums. So you just want to sprinkle them down the table. One other thing which is really nice is you could do, real quickly, doing an orb of anything solid round ball, completely cover it, you can just stick it in a vase and just gives you a roundness of all the round vases shapes. Um, then you could do a simple little carnations, you could do an orb again, just round, piece of decorative wire, wrap it around there gives you the same effect of what the roundness is. It's how quick and simple that is. Now, you can do two ways. You can just sprinkle with some pumpkins, some gourds. You can do any size pumpkin too. You can put a big old honker in there, some green. Then, collect leaves. It can be any kind of leaf. These are oak leaves just turning color right now. Just sprinkle them down the table. How simple and easy that is. Now if you wanted to change the look of it, you could add some decorative gems. You now if you wanted to pull the orange into it, you could pull the orange into the vases if you wanted to. You can put a little bit of red to pull the red gabarras together. See, it changes the whole concept of the table of pulling the gems into it. So it depends if you want to do a real natural look. You could even pull some of your rocks into it. Acorns, you could pull uh, walnuts. Anything that's growing right now, you could pull that into the centerpieces itself. Whammo getting use of all your vases that you have in your garage that you don't know what to do with. And um, then you have a nice simple centerpiece that you can use the whole month. You can even change it out at Christmas time, pulling some holly into it, changing your leaves out, putting a few Christmas greens or some cedar around in there. Keep it real simple and easy. That's what it's all about. Thank you.